What's up everybody? This is Michael from Just Press Play. We're down here in Paso Grill. We're gonna take a walk around the loop. Probably go about a little over halfway all the way around the loop. So this place is pretty cool. It's kind of like, uh, would it remind me of what Florida was like, maybe in the 50s, 60s maybe. So this place is pretty cool. I forgot the name of it. We'll look at it on the way out, but it's a small little, small little uh, condos or townhomes, but pretty neat. Let's walk around and check it out. It's Monday, nobody here hardly, not like uh, Saturday and Sunday, you can even find a parking spot. But we're right next to the Brass Monkey. Let's take a walk around the loop. recommend this place but brass monkey was probably about a two it's more like a bar i wouldn't go there for the food uh, we had like we both had the fried shrimp not much taste to it maybe if you want drinks maybe let's keep walking so far then uh a little disappointed with the food we had this place here too hurricanes and they had uh two fryers go out we didn't know it we got our grouper and our fries and it, we couldn't even eat it it was just tasted severely burned so instead of giving our money back they just took ten dollars off so hurricane you might want to look at your uh, management recommend this place until they get better management and the drinks are really high too Really good breakfast over here this morning. Great price too. It was enough food for both of us. We spent with tip, it was like 20 bucks. I'll take it here and show you the menu. Monday. 
Up of what we have for uh, breakfast, there. Huge portion of food stuff. So, everywhere we've had breakfast here has been great. Still haven't found that meal, good seafood meal yet. We'll try again this afternoon. Maybe. It's definitely not as crowded today. You can hardly walk across the road down here yesterday. Take a look at some of these beach side homes, they're cool. So you can walk this whole loop of passenger rail maybe in. 30 40 minutes. Neat little place. We're on the ocean side now. Here in a minute, we'll switch over to the bay side. Some more restaurants over that way. I'll show you the other places we have breakfast. The only trouble here when it gets crowded is the parking. You may have to ride around for 20 minutes to find parking, but not today. Like I said, it's Monday, May 17th, 2021. Down to probably 14th Ave. And we'll walk over to the bay side. A lot of remodeling going on. You can cross any of these uh, avenues here. You'd be over on the bay side. Let's go down to 14th. Pretty cool looking home around here. Let's check it out. I have to put a picture of some of these birds on here. I think I got them on a later video. With somebody to help me figure out what they are. They kind of look like uh, a parrot that's crossed with something. 
or they might just be parrots, I'm not sure. Home or a lot just sold. This one's for sale. I wonder how much it is. Take a guess. How much is this house? Right across from the beach. Got a cool little end right here. All right, let's cross over to the bay side. Nice infinity pool right there. A little breezier on the bay side, but it actually feels good. It's probably already eh, close to 80 down here already. Yesterday I got it about at least 90. Beautiful day. Our last day here, we're flying home tonight. A lot of remodeling. Show you some of the shops, a couple of the restaurants. Breeze feels good. People here are really friendly as well. There's a free show. Give me a free ride anywhere. Just got to tip the driver. difference in the weekend crowding today. We want the more laid back 
Bays definitely come during the week in May. We actually had to park on the bay side yesterday when we're staying on the ocean side. So crowded. You have a dog I'll try to catch it you can't have a uh, dogs on the uh, beach side of the beach but you can bring them over to this other beach on the bay side building. Right here we got a little park. We got tennis. See pickleball and shuffleboard down this way. Or maybe that's on over to the right. They just got shuffleboard here and a little picnic area. There's a neat little uh, arch store up ahead. Definitely unique. Good voice. Coming up on the right here, we have breakfast here twice. The uh, Seahorse, probably one of the best places to have breakfast. A little bit more uh, expensive than Paradise Grill, but it's good. They were actually right on the same boat. A little more variety of this one. I'll show a picture of what we had in the video there. Pretty cool, boys. A lot of dogs here, too. 
across the road, you can take a uh, Sunset Cruise or Shell Cruise over here at the pier. And we'll come back around. Here's some of the some of the shops over here on Eighth Avenue. Good morning. How you doing? All right. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. Come back to eight and look at those shops. So we'll take you down here and show you the dog beach. to catch anything. There is probably the tallest building in Passivira. We'll look when we go on the other side. Maybe those two are about the same size. I think they're totally remodeling those. That's what makes this place a little unique. It's not really too commercial yet. Hopefully it'll stay that way. Bicyclists here too.
the beach, you see it here. That's where you can take your dogs. Or just hang out the beach either one. I prefer the ocean side, but whatever your taste is. Dog beach. <laughs> Let's go beach <wait> for <laughs> turns into a private beach. We're back down first half. We're gonna circle back around to the ocean side. Cool place here. Good morning. Hello. 
some unique cactuses on this pond. That's pretty neat. Huh. Interesting. It's almost like our ivy back home. See her back to the ocean side, circling back around. Morning. I'm gonna take my shoes off. Really quiet today compared to yesterday. We've been walking about, about 35 minutes. Let's see. Cool little homes here. Good morning. Hi. Got a uh, historic hotel coming up to the right. Castle Hotel. Definitely looks like a cool place to stay. Check this place out. These are the two tallest buildings you'll see here. That's it. Six, seven stories. Hey, how you doing, man?
almost back. We walked a pretty good pace, so like I said, maybe 45 minutes. Maybe an hour if you went all the way around. The girl coming to me, and so we're back. I'll go here in a minute. We'll go down 8th Street and I'll show you some of the shops. So, 8th Avenue is where a lot of the shopping is. So, let's take a little quick walk down 8th Avenue. Thank you. 